Hey guys, Retro Adam here, um, and today I just wanted to make a video about how I'm going to continue doing the shorts that I've been doing um, without certain games that I don't own. Um, so what I'm just going to do, I explained it a little bit in a previous video, but in uh, today I just want to show you how I'm going to do it. Um, so I have the Super Console X Cube here, and this is a device, uh, basically an emulator device, uh, and it uses um, HDMI to hook up to um, newer TVs. But I wanted it to hook it up to the CRT, so I needed to, to buy um, I needed to buy a converter, which is right here. So this is, goes HDMI to RCA. Um, so I'm going to quickly hook that up right now and just show you what it looks like, and then you'll have an idea of what the games are going to look like uh, through this device. So let me just quickly hook that up uh, really quick here. Um, so HDMI goes into there, and then I just need to uh, plug it in as well because it needs to power source. So I'll plug that in there, and then that's the audio. And then I'm just gonna quickly uh, plug this in, so just a second. This can go down here. Okay, so now that I got all that plugged in, uh, this is the controller I'll be using, so I just need to pop that in real quick. And then hopefully you can see it there. Yeah, just have it hooked up there. And I'm going to power it on. It says no signal at the moment, but it should be turning on. There you go. So now it's turned on. And... Uh, Hopefully this way you'll kind of see uh, what to expect from, from short. So basically any games, NES games that I don't have as of yet, I'm, I'm hoping to show it this, this way. Um, so yeah, here, let me just um, uh, load this up for you. It'll just take a moment. Because normally I show you the game and then I pop it in the NES and then show you a bit of gameplay. But I unfortunately don't own... A ton of games. I have about 110 NES games, but at least this way I can still show you some gameplay from other games that I don't own. Um, so this will kind of just give you an idea of what to expect. Let me just play with the brightness here for a second. Hopefully uh, you can see that. So let's go to NES here. Uh, there's also some, <laughs> I'd like to show some NES hacks too, that'd be kind of cool. Uh, so let's jump into, let's we'll say Blaster Master, I guess. So this will be what it looks like uh, through the emulator device. I got this device from um, AliExpress. And there's the audio there. Hopefully you can hear that. So it looks pretty good even on um, through the, the converter. So it looks like I'm actually playing on an actual Nintendo here. I'll just go through a few games just to kind of, you know, give you an idea. Ow! Because I really wanted to still showcase the games on the CRT. Um, and not on like a modern television. Um, I feel like this is more authentic. Because I grew up playing most of my games on this television. I think I actually I played NES all the way up to PlayStation N64 kind of era uh, with this television. So it has a, it brings a lot of uh, nostalgia, nostalgic memories for me um, using this. Boop, 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 boop. Uh, so yeah, it looks pretty good. Um, so let's try another game. I've ordered a NES controller, USB controller as well, because I don't want to be using a Super Nintendo styled controller to, to showcase NES games. Um, let's check out a couple here. Let's try Bobo Bobble. So the shorts will kind of, you know, they'll just jump straight into the gameplay uh, without showing the actual cartridge, um, which kind of sucks, but at least that way I can still show you you know, new games that you might not have heard of. But yeah, this looks pretty good. It feels like I'm actually playing on a 
the regular Nintendo. Just turn the brightness down a bit. Does that look a better? Yeah, it's a bit better. But yeah, let me know in the comments how you feel about this. Uh, if you're okay with uh, me showing showcasing the games like this uh, through the emulator. Ah! Let's check out a couple other games too. A little bit of a loading screen there. Uh, let's do let's do Castlevania. So yeah, this emulator device has like just tons and tons of games, like 50,000 games or something like that. So it's just absolutely ridiculous. I mean, yeah, look at that. That looks really good. So Castle I don't own Castlevania, the original. I have two and two and three, um, but I do not have Castlevania one. So this would be a way to showcase, um, you know, some gameplay without actually owning the cartridge. I'm thinking like when I do get the cartridge, then you know, then I'll maybe I'll go back and and re-upload it as with the cartridge. But uh, yeah, this looks pretty good. It's not too bad at all. And this way, I can show some like hacks and stuff too. Uh, so why don't we do one more? Um, Just jump back into my favorites here and see what else we got. I uh, got Chip and Dale. Uh, Double Dragon, Dragon Warrior. All the Dragon Warriors are here. Final Fantasy. Uh, let's do here. Let's do Mega Man Two, I guess. Whoa. Yeah, but this looks awesome for, uh, let's go to Woodman stage. I think this looks awesome for, uh, playing off an emulator device. God, this game's so good. Like, Mega Man 2 has to be one of the best games ever made. But uh, yeah, I think you got the idea. Um, ah! Let me just kill this dog first. There you go. Um, so yeah, there you go. Um, here, I'll turn it down a bit. So that's a way I'm gonna show some NES games. I mean, the other cool thing about this is, you know, I can show a bunch of other systems too that I don't own um, on here as well. Um, even like Super Nintendo games look really good. Uh, maybe here, maybe I'll show a quick Super Nintendo game. Uh, let's do... There's like Donkey Kong or something. Yeah, here's Donkey Kong. So Donkey Kong, I don't own, um, at least this way. I can show some gameplay to, uh, through these methods. So I just, the short, I would just start it right from here instead of showing the cartridge. Um, but yeah, like still looks really good for um, HDMI conversion. And, uh, yeah, there you go. Donkey Kong. I always like to, like, go through the top part up here. Oops. I always like to try and get the, the one-ups up here. There you go. Bonk. 
So yeah, any questions, let me know in the comments. Um, if you want to know how I did this, how I set it up so that it plays on the CRT, uh, I can let you know what I've purchased. Um, much more cool uh, retro game content coming, and we'll see you on the next one. Take care, guys. Bye.